Hey guys, so this is the little lilac bell pepper that I showed you guys yesterday for the first time. And as I said, it's only about three weeks old, but I mean the growth is absolutely ridiculous. Um, great, great stem strength. Um, you know, this guy's holding up really, really well. Wonderful new growth. Look at that color change on it. These are gonna be really sweet, really um, really tasty when they come out. Um, very excited, I've never seen a purple bell pepper before. Um, but once again, thanks to Pepper Joe's, I think we're gonna have a, a wonderful harvest this year, at least with these uh, pepper plants. So, what I wanted to show you guys today specifically um, was a little bit about how I prune my plants and how I crop them. Um, for higher yields and so that I can get uh, more fruits off a single plant. So there are two methods that I use mainly um, and they're pretty much the most common methods. You can look them up and find tons of information about them um, from multiple great sites. Um, topping and thimming are the two methods that we're going to talk about today. Um, both of these methods um, are incredibly useful if you're trying to uh, produce more off a single plant and increase your yields. This is going to help you dramatically. Um, don't be scared to do it. I know it looks like uh, like it's pretty young, but um, it's absolutely strong enough for it. Um, I know it can be kind of scary to just cut whole bits off of your plant. Um, you know, especially after you've put so much time into getting them to come out from seed and making sure that they stay healthy. Um, you know, lopping off uh, a portion of it doesn't exactly seem like the best idea. But it's okay. It will help. Um, so I'm going to, for this pepper, I'm going to thim it. Um, now, thimming quite literally stands for fuck I missed. Um, so it, basically it's like topping a plant, but you screw it up on purpose. Um, when you top a plant, you would take your scissors and you would go in and cut right about here, just above this node, above these two leaves, and remove the entire top portion of the plant. So that would be these two leaves here and these guys in the center. Now with thimming, you're only going to cut off a, a smaller portion. You're going to go in right where this newest growth is here. You can see where it separates a bit. And I'm going to go right in. Let's see if I can do this. Get these. In a little bit more sorry for the bad camera angle guys it's my first time doing this so we're gonna go right in like that I know my scissors look dirty but they have been sterilized multiple times they're just a little bit old so we're gonna go in and we're gonna cut that was messy so what I'm gonna do um, after this video is go back in and recut that just so that it's a little bit cleaner um, but what you can see is that I've just cut off the top sections of those leaves, basically. Not the whole thing. There's still growth there. It's still attached. But that will allow for more colas um, and a uh, higher production. So when I show this to you guys in about another two weeks or so, this is all going to explode out, and we're going to have a much larger bushier plant um, just from that one little cut it's going to make a big difference um, so I am going to end this video here so I can go ahead and clean up that cut I don't want to leave it sitting nasty like that for too long um, but thanks for watching I really appreciate it and I uh, hope you check out my other videos I'll be back soon and uh, this is Rob with Garden of the Sun